सदाशिव सरंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमा अस्मदाचार्य पर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा ओ सुखम नित्यम स्वप्रकाशम व्यापक नाम अधिष्ठान बुद्ध्यबोध्यम बुद्धिर्दृग्यप्त निर्मल अपारम सर्वेदेद्यम प्रत्यक् तदेवाहम न मोन्दी मे निश्चिता मति विचार सागर फिफ्थ चैप्टर पेज वन हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी नाइन फर्स्ट लाइन तैतिरी आकाश वायुवाग्निजल पृथ्वी नाम पंचभूता क्रमेण उत्पत्ति श्रूयते तस्मात्म आकाशसंभूत निश्चलदासा आंसरिंग द क्वेश्चन ऑफ अदृष्टि रिगार्डिंग द क्रिएशन एंड इट्स ऑर्डर ऑर्डर ऑफ क्रिएशन मीन्स सृष्टि क्रम इन शास्त्र देर इज नो इनकसीस्टेंसी There is no consistency with regard to the creation. The students question. That means, uh, one one Upanishad says one order of creation differently. Chandogya Upanishad talks about uh, the Srishti begins with uh, Agni, Apaha, and Prithvi. Whereas the Itri Upanishad talks about the Srishti from the Atma, next Akasha, Vayu, Agni. There is a krama in number also, but in Chandogya number is different. In Kaivalya Upanishad and Mundaka Upanishad, there is a Vyutkrama Srishti. Vyutkrama Srishti. There are three types of Srishti. Krama Srishti. That means sequentially, one by one, one by one, order comes. Five elements first born, later only fourteen lokas will come. This is krama srishti. First sukshma bhutani, then sthula bhutani, then body, mind complex, all these will come. But in some other Upanishads, it is said that fourteen lokas are born first. In either way, open is it? Fourteen lokas born first, later elements. This is called yutkrama srishti, the reversal order of srishti. And uh, akrama srishti means uh, there is uh, no um, number in sequential form. That is uh, Kaivalya Upanishad also said, uh, krama srishti, yutkrama srishti, akrama srishti. So these are all uh, given with Krama Srishti given in Mundaka Upanishad. Krama Srishti, um, Akrama Srishti means simultaneously born. Everything is simultaneous. It is called Akrama Srishti. That means no Krama. Krama Srishti means there is a sequential order. Krama means say sequential order is there. Akrama means simultaneously everything comes at a time. Yutkrama means reverse order. That means lokas come first and elements born later. Karya comes first, karana comes later. Like that it shows. So these are all differences are there. Therefore, Adrishti asked why like this? 
why this type of uh, inconsistency for that nishaladasa answering there is no tatparyam in the srishti anyhow we are going to negate that is a nishedham only srishti a topic there is no tatparyam therefore there is no necessity of consistency that is the idea there is no necessity of consistency where there is tatparyam only you need consistency sequential order paddhati is required just like uh, while serving the food uh, in different houses they serve differently but that sampradaya is uh, which side which item you have to serve in the food leaf that banana leaf they keep and the items one by one they have to um, serve but in certain houses they differently they serve but achara prakaram they have to serve sweet first then uh, like that items are there not curds first <laughs> curds should not be served first vegetables to be served then sambar then rasam like that there is a paddhati if they don't have sweet at least banana they keep if they don't have that also sugar they will keep like that then achara is their krama is their in serving but eating time you cannot ask you should eat this only first there is no order in eating anything you can eat it differs person to person so in andhra they don't eat sambar first in tamil nadu they take on sambar first like that there are differences similarly here also in taitri upanishad look into the top line taitriye aakasha vayu agni jala prithvi five elements are systematically panchabhutanam five elements kramena science sequentially rest kramena means sequentially one by one one by one one after the other kramena means one after the other they are born it is said in taitri upanishad shruyate means shruti vakyam we hear this is only adhyaropa it is adhyaropa tasmadva etasmad atmanah aakasha sambhutah ಆಕಾಶದ್ ವಾಯು ವಾಯೋ ಅಗ್ನಿ ಅಗ್ನಿ ರಾಪ ಯು ನೋ ದಿಸ್ ಮಂತ್ರ ಇನ್ ತೈತ್ರಿ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ವಿ ಸಾ ಎಲಾಬರೇಟ್ಲಿ ಸಂಭೂತ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಬಾಂಡ್ ಇತ್ಯಾದಿ ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಟಾಕಿಂಗ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಸೀಕ್ವೆನ್ಷಿಯಲ್ ಸೃಷ್ಟಿ ಬಟ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ತೈತ್ರಿ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಅಪ್ ಟು ಹಿಯರ್ ವಿ ಸಾ ಇನ್ ದ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ತೈತ್ರಿ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಾನಂದವಲ್ಲಿ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಮಂತ್ರ ತಸ್ಮಾತ್ಮನ ಆಕಾಶ ಸಂಭೂತ ಅಪ್ ಟು ಹಿಯರ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ದೇ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಗಿವೆನ್ ಲೇಟರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಕಾಮ್ಸ್ ಆಕಾಶಾದ ವಾಯು ವಾಯೋರಗ್ನಿ ಅಗ್ನಿರಾಪ ಅಭ್ಯ ಪೃಥಿವಿ ಪೃಥಿವ್ಯಾಂ ಓಷಧಯ ಓಷಧಿಭ್ಯೋನ್ನ ಅನ್ನಾತ್ ಪುರುಷ ದಿಸ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ತೈತ್ರೇಯ ಮಂತ್ರ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಾನಂದವಲ್ಲಿ ನಂಬರ್ ಒನ್ ಇತ್ಯಾದಿ ಬಟ್ ಲೇಟರ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದೇರ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ರೀಡ್ ಪಚಿಚ್ಚ ಪರಮೇಶ್ವರ ಸರ್ವಸೃಜತ ಕ್ರಮಮಂತರ ಉತ್ಪತ್ತಿ ಶ್ರೂಯತೆ ಇದಂ ಸರ್ವಸೃಜತ ಇತ್ಯಾದಿ ಕ್ವಚಿಚ್ಚ ಇನ್ ಸಮ್ ಪ್ಲೇಸಸ್ of the same taitri upanishad brahmananda valli again sixth anuvaka you see only 2 3 4 5 four anuvakas later what a inconsistency taitri upanishad first mantra talks about sequential srishti the sixth anuvaka talks about uh, idam sarvam asrujata parameshwara ishvara ಸರ್ವಂ ಅಸೃಜತ ಇತಿ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಕ್ರಮ ಅಂತರ ಏವ ವಿತೌಟ್ ಕ್ರಮ ವಿತೌಟ್ ಎನಿ ಆರ್ಡರ್ ಉತ್ಪತ್ತಿ ಶ್ರೂಯತೆ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಎಗೇನ್ ದ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಷನ್ ಈಸ್ ಸೆಡ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇದಂ ಸರ್ವಂ ಅಸೃಜತ ದ ಎಂಟೈರ್ ಯೂನಿವರ್ಸ್ ಈಶ್ವರ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟೆಡ್ ನೋ ಆರ್ಡರ್ 
entire thing at a time he created. This is the Anuvaka. Ityadina. This also is there. That also is there. Where is the consistency? Shruti is confused or I am confused. I do not know. Hey Guru, tell me. Itham Vedeshu Jagadutpatte He Nana Prakarina Varnanam Varnanasya Varnanasya Ayamashaya Jagan Mithya Eva Mithya Eva Vastubhutam Vastubhutam Chet Jagat Syatam Tadutpati Kramaham Tadutpati Kramaham Varnana Varnana Syam I am Ashayaha Tadutpati Kramaha Vede Shun Anna Vede Vede Shu Vedeshur Akram Vedeshur There is some mis letter is missing here Nak Prakari na na uchate uchate vastuni vikalpa asambhavat atasche upanishadam jagadutpati krami na tatpariyam brahmanaha adviti atva varnani paramatatpariyam Tadanga Bhutena Jagan Nishedhasya Vivakshitatvat Nishedhyatvan Na Akshiptasya Jagataha Yatha Kathanchit Aropaha Kartavyaha Ityevatat Paryam Up to here we will see Itham, in this manner, Vedeshu, in Vedas, in Upanishads, Jagad Utpattehe, in the case of creation of this universe. Nana Prakarena, there are different types, varieties of presentation, Varnanasya, Varnanasya means the description. This is very important portion. Varnanasya, the description. Varnanasya, I am Ashayaha. This is the opinion of the Upanishad. Intention of the Upanishad. Ashayaha means intention. What is the intention of Upanishad? Jagat Mithya Eva. The world, what we are talking about, it is created. This world is only Mithya. Mithya Eva. It is only, uh, it is dependent upon the observer. Ityartha. It is dependent upon the Sakshi Chaitanyam or Brahman. Mithya Eva. Vastu Bhutam. Vastu Bhutam Chet. If it is real. Vastu means Vastavikata. Vastu, that is called if it is real. If it is a independent of observer. If it is independent of observer, Chet, Jagat Syat. If Jagat is Jagat Vastu Bhutam Syat. If world is real, independent of the observer, then what? Tadutpati Kramaha Vedeshu. Vedeshu Akrama Prakarena Na Ucheta It would have been It would have not mentioned This Akrama It would have talked about Krama only 
when if there is a tatparyam if it has got independent existence world is dependently existing upon me the observer if it is vastu bhutam chet if it is real if it is having independent existence it would have been said in the upanishads krama prakarena akrama prakarena na ucheta it would have not said this inconsistently if it has got uh, independent existence upanishad would have not said in this inconsistent manner akrama prakarena vedeshu um here some one letter is something wrong here let me let me correct later okay as this in this manner inconsistently it would have not mentioned so vastuni uh, vikalpa asambhavat if it is real jagat is real vikalpa is not possible vikalpa means uh, vaividhyam nana prakaraka uh, explanation in different ways vikalpa vikalpa means what sometimes uh, orderly creation sometimes uh, uh, sequential sometimes uh, simultaneous this type of vikalpa either this or that like that this vikalpa would have not been mentioned vastuni vastuni means veda cannot change the fact vikalpah nasyatu vastuni vastuni means the fact the fact can never be changed veda would have not changed the fact it cannot change the fact but it is not a fact jagat is not a fact therefore atah therefore upanishadam in upanishads jagat utpatti krame in with regard to the order of this creation na tatparyam there is no tatparyam it is not a purport it is not the central teaching tatparyam how can you translate tatparya means there is no um, purport or there is no uh, what can you say tatparya na tatparya it is not the message it is not the central message of the upanishads veda is not very much bother about that because there is no tatparyam there is no reality in that that is why that is why here by lord krishna also says in bhagavad gita mastani sarva bhutani next line he says nachamastani bharata and everything is in me i am not uh, in everything you know. like that he says mastani sarva bhutani all bhutam sar is in me nachamastani they are not in me so like that here also krishna followed upanishad only you no know, tatparyam na tatparyam ब्रह्मण अद्वितीय वर्णने देर फोर वैल टाकिंग अबउट द नॉन् ज्युवल ब्रह्मण ब्रह्मण अद्वितीय वर्णन मीनस डिस्क्रिप्शन आफ नॉन् ज्युवल ब्रह्मण वर्णन मीन्स डिस्क्रिप्शन अद्वितीय मीन्स नॉन् ज्युवल इन विद रिगार्ड टू द डिस्क्रिप्शन आफ द नॉन् ज्युवल ब्रह्मण परम tatparyam tad angatvena there is su- parama tatparyam that is the central message that is the th- supreme <laughs> means highest topmost final ultimate message angatvena jagad utpatti uh, jagan nishedhasya so angatvena means as a part of discussion as a part of discussion about srishti means um, see all people cannot accept the srishti when we say this world is mithya na who will accept mithya means remember here world is unreal when we say you have to carefully note please if you don't uh, understand properly you will uh, confuse others i say always world is unreal in the sense world experience is not unreal 
world experience is real world has got etu paramarthananda swami says world has got experienceability world has got transactability world has got utility etu experienceability is there in the world we never negate that transactability is there we are transacting with the world we never negate that utility also is there we never negate that but what we negate we negate we means vedanta upanishad negates the reality of the world you cannot say there is atyantika satyatvam in the world it is real 100% real you cannot say experientially real okay whatever experientially real you cannot establish it is fact since i am experiencing the world therefore it is real it, this logic will not stand why this logic cannot stand whatever i experience must be real shastra won't accept you experience many things which are not real for example sunrise you are experiencing is it real no earth is stationary you are experiencing is it real no sun is not rising is the fact earth is not stationary is the fact earth is moving violently what happened to your experienceability your experience is falsified similarly how can you say this experienceability of the world is real now just like sunrise is real for your experience factually it is unreal similarly the world is experienceable for you but it cannot be real like that here also for junior students who are not mature enough who cannot accept the world mithyatvam it is unreal seemingly real we could say seemingly real it is only an appearance for junior students say upanishad to talk about creation not for senior students vichara sagara students are supposed to be senior students Hmm? senior students means uh, jagat uh, srishti is only adhyaropa it is only adhyaropa superimposition upanishad comes down to the level of the uh, junior student who is not able to accept because he is having or she is having a notion that world is born creation is there this creation is real so vehemently they argue when they are arguing like that they are accepting the creation is real upanishad cannot straight away say there is no creation so upanishad slowly comes down to the level of that student and upanishad join with that uh, wrong notion of the junior student and upanishad also go along with that therefore upanishad start adhyaropa ah uh, ah uh, yes yes there is creation then the student is also very happy ah the creation is there so this is the way of teaching of upanishad it straight away it will not refute you your opinions it slowly comes and it gives time for the student to grow mature until he mature it gives takes the adhyaropa superimposition world is created born from atma brahman is the cause world is the effect akasha vayu agni fire elements are born ah very nice this is very nice oshadhayas oh, anna purushah ah i am born because of annam annam is born of earth earth is born out of water water is born out of fire fire is born out of air air is born out of space space is born out of uh, atma excellent and student is so happy clapping upanishad looks at the student <laughs> junior student ah how long you can be happy some time only this is only superimposition after some time i am going to negate this 
once you are a senior student now this is for senior students hmm? for senior students sake vichara sagara nischala dasa is talking apavada negation anyhow we are going to negate it once we are going to negate it where is the tatparya either krama is there akrama is there bhut krama is there that is not necessary at all when it is not there at all it is like a dream you see in the dream experience is there e t u is there in the dream for a dreamer dream experienceability dream transactability dream utility all are there for you the waker they are all unreal once you wake up dream is unreal how can you say so dream is real for dreamer from waker standpoint you want to negate the dream go for a dreamer level you cannot say dream is unreal uh, different standards you know either you have to accept both dream is also real waking world is also real for dreamer waking world is not there for dreamer waking world is not there for waker dream world is not there not real similarly for a gnani for a senior student it means gnani for a gnani this world is also like that only for a waker the one who is having dvaita buddhi not understanding the mahavakya giving reality to the world for that person it is real not for a gnani for a gnani who understood the upanishadic teaching properly just as for you the waker dream is unreal for a gnani who has woken up to his atman nature for him or her jagat is also same like another dream we saw in mandukya upanishad advaita prakaranam vaitathya prakaranam advaita prakaranam you look into that whole world gaudapada acharya negate negate in the sense it's a factuality its reality we take out that's all we do that is mithyatva nischayam nishedha means what baadha mithyatva nischayam okay world is not there means understand experience we never negate we negate the reality in the dual dual world that is the understanding if you understand wonderful otherwise don't tell others don't confuse others okay waker dreamer how much difference is there for a gnani waker world dreamer world both are similar atha swapnam tatha jagrati okay that is why um, here he says ataha cha upanishadam jagadutpatti krame na tatparyam brahmani advitiya varnane while talking brahman as non dual there is no second thing there is no second real thing when we want to say atma is real there is no second real entity and then world has to become unreal therefore he says tad angatvena jagan nishedhasya as you say there is no second thing what is the second part the nishedha whatever you see second thing it is only an appearance only an appearance nishedhasya it is negatable it is negated to be negated vivakshitatvat this is the this is to be negated this is the teaching vivakshitatvat nishedhya nishedhyatvat nishedhyatvena akshiptasya the one who argues jagataha jagataha of this world the one who argue see when we want if you want jagat hmm, clear real and all you join with the sankhya philosopher mahat 
prakriti, mahat, ahankara, we borrow from that also. And you join Sankhya philosopher. If you want, because for him world is real. For Visistha, Dvaiti, Dvaiti, for all of them, world is real. World is not unreal for them. Then, if you want world to be real, you join in that party. If you don't want world is real, Upanishad is telling world is unreal, seemingly real, or it is uh, an apparently real, apparently real. It is only an apparent. If you want that, you can join in Vedanta. That's a two choice. You have either that side or this side. Jagataha Yatha Kadhanchid Aropaha Kartavyaha. We have to do some Aropa. Yatha Kadhanchit somehow or other. Okay. In a in any uh, in any order. In any order something aro adhyaropa to be done. Kartavyaha Ityeva Tatparyam. That alone is the Upanishadic attempt. Okay, this is the central message. Central message in the somehow we have to introduce the uh, this Upanishad, na, Utpatti, Srishti, for the sake of those people who are accepting vehemently about this creation. That's why in one shloka, Upaya um, Sovataraya Nasti Veda Kadhanchana Sishyanam Sukhabodhaya Tatvagnai Kalpita Kramaha. We do not know where from this shloka source. Upaya Sovataraya. There are so many upayams are there. Um, Sovataraya. Nasti Veda Kadhanchana. Really speaking, there is no Veda at all. There is only non dual Brahman. But then why Upanishad talks about so much of difference, Krik, Srishti, uh, all these things, why Upanishad comes down to the level of the student, the junior student and all. Sishyanam Sukhabodhaya, for the sake of easy teaching methodology, Sukhabodhaya, Tattvagnehi Kalpitakrama, wise people have done this type of Aropa, Aropa, Adhyaropa. Kalpita Kramha. That shloka is not here. Just you know, many times I told about the shloka. Kartaveha ityeva tatparyam. So therefore, Tatrayam drishtantaha Leelartham kaschana Kritrimam gajam Nirmaya yantrenatam Akashe utthapayati Akasham Akasha Gamana Samaye Tasse Gajasye Karna Vala Yava Avayaveshu Vakrata Sampatta Tas Sami Karanaya Sa Purushahana Prayatate Eva Meva Brahmanaha Adviti Yatva Gnana Siddhaye Dvaita Rupaha Drishya Prapanchaha Nishedhartham kalpitaha. <coughs> now, Nishchaladasa gives an example. It is just like Tatra, with regard to this creation, order, there is no Tatparyam, it is falsified anyhow. Therefore, for the sake of teaching purpose, it is taught Tatra, with regard to this, there is a Example, Drishtantaha. I will give you one example. Nishchaladasa says, What is that example? Leelartham, a father, one father wants to play with his son. So he made a, with a paper mesh one uh, gajaha, elephant. Leelartham means as a sport, as a play. Kaschena, one person, Krutrimam, artificial elephant, gajam. Artificial Kritrima means a paper or some um, no, thermocol like that. Some elephant he made. Nirmaya having created. Yantrena and he arranged the key also for that or mission inside. So that mission is operated, it goes up. That elephant goes up. 
यंत्रेण बै मिशन तम तम गजम आकाशे उत्थापयति ही सेंड्स दट एलिफेंट अपवर्ड्स फॉल्स एलिफेंट कृत्रिम गजम ही सेंड्स अपवर्ड्स हाउ ही सेंड थ्रू ए मिशन न दैट यू नो दे गिव की लाइक दिस गिर इट गोस अप उत्थापयति After it goes up, what happened? Akasha gamana samaye. When the gaja, that krutrimam gajam, false elephant, paper doll, like elephant going up, up and all. What happens at that time? Tasya gajasya of that elephant, karna, not its ear. <coughs> it has got big ears, no? Uh, that elephant has got big ears. Karna, wal, waladi means tail. <coughs> Tamil Nadu also wall only. Okay, wall as it means uh, tail. Uh, avaya veshu in that avaya va limbs. Yeah, vakrata sampatta. So, Sometimes when it is going up, the ear of the elephant just twisted. It right? vakrata means twisted. Suppose. Vala uh, vakrata di sam vakrata sampatta. Either in the tail or in the ear. इट दट इट इज गॉट ट्विस्टेड समीकरण टू करेक्ट इट इट हेज गॉन अप वेरी हई इट वेट थ्रू द मिशन दिस पर्सन विल गो एंड ही हेज टू करेक्ट इन दट इयर स्ट्रेट इन द इयर स्ट्रेट इन द टेल समीकरण न पुष न प्रयते सह पुष दट पर्सन हू मेड दिस Artificial elephant, he will not try to correct that twist, no, uh, twisted ear and tail. He will not go and try because he cannot go with the mission only. Elephant has gone up. He need not try for that. Eva, eva. In this manner, same way. Brahmana, ha. Or this Brahman also. What type of Brahman? Advitiyatva, no, secondless Brahman. ज्ञान सिद्ध द पर्सन टू गेट दिस नॉलेज टू गिव दिस नॉलेज सिद्ध मीन टू अकॉम्प्लिश टू एक्वायर टू अटेन द नॉलेज ऑफ द नॉन ज्यूअल ब्रह्मण द्वैत रूप दृश्य प्रपंच दिस प्रपंच इज दृश्यम ऑब्जेक्ट ऑब्जेक्टिव यूनिवर्स निषेधार्थम कल इट इज ओनली टू नेगेट इट इज सुप्रीम पोज नाट टू टाक अबउट द रियालिटी ऑफ द वर्ल्ड इट इज टू नेगेट ओनली इट इज टेम्पररीली इट इज सुप्रीम पोज द स्टूडेंट इज पर्मनेंटली एक्सेप्टिंग द वर्ल्ड पर्मनेंटली थिंकिंग दट देर इज ए वर्ल्ड When he is or she is permanently thinking there is a world, what the Upanishad has to do? Temporarily, Upanishad has to accept the world until the student comes to the level of that Upanishadic teaching level, understanding that Upanishadic teaching, what Upanishad want to teach. Until he comes to that level, Upanishad temporarily, temporarily. reason temporarily accept the creation for the junior student sake who accept the creation as permanent see that is why i said upanishad is having lot of karuna compassion not understanding this compassion of the upanishad people blame the vedas without studying without understanding nobody knows what is bharata mahabharata essence message hmm? our um, our foreign minister uh, and that foreign secretary foreign uh, jay shankar he was talking somebody was asking who is the diplomat uh, what is the strategy and uh, when he they are talking jay shankar was telling the great strategist diplomat is lord krishna and hanuman 
who is other than hanuman and lord krishna who is the great diplomat in this world after lord krishna and hanuman only anyone can you can include in mahabharata the strategy the diplomacy in ramayana hanuman and in mahabharata lord krishna great diplomats that is why we follow their diplomatism and diplomatism is there or not i do not know the diplomatic uh, uh, tricks diplomatic we can't say tricks diplomatic uh, uh, intelligence that we make use of and uh, hanuman also while uh, meeting uh, sita while going to lanka what a diplomacy strategy and he was talking very beautifully please listen to that jay shankar is uh, telling so it is uh, our uh, heritage it is our greatness we need not borrow anybody's uh, uh, westerners uh, diplomacy strategy we have plenty of diplomats here okay in our puranas so therefore kalpita kalpitaha nishedartham kalpitaha for the sake of negation it is superimposed on superimposed thing which is going to be negated why you are so much of uh, uh, vehemently and adamant uh, towards this creation when guru says uh, this world is mithya and uh, student turn their head oh, how can it be mithya my son is real my daughter is real my house is real my car is real okay which ko if you want real in live in unreality taking it as real you are only the sufferer not upanishad not the guru not the acharyas okay that's a kalpita just as a person will not try to correct that doll which is false only it went through the mission he need not go and adjust correct it similarly upanishad need not bother about why kaivalya upanishad said like this mundaka upanishad said like this all upanishads talk their own way of creation they don't uh, have any uh, compassion towards this world superimposed world why to have compassion there is no need of compassion towards mithya vastu <laughs> okay that is the idea now he is bringing here in this uh, portion giving answer to the senior students junior students those who want to live in this unreal universe as real continue you have your own choice no hurry upanishad is called this is called anuvada vakyam the that quoting of upanishad um, what uh, the mistake of the student junior student taking the unreal creation as real that mistake upanishad repeats upanishad quotes <laughs> i'll repeat once again the mistake of the junior student means what unrefined student and ardha who is not mature enough who has uh, not received the teaching properly who is not thoroughly studied shastra properly that student his mistake upanishad repeats upanishad repeats in the sense upanishad uh, again quote that statement of that mistake of that student that is called srishti in the upanishad that is called srishti that quoting the mistake of that junior student as adhyaropa in the srishti vishaya is called anuvada vakyam tasmadva etasmad atmanah akasha sambhutah is anuvada vakyam murlogha vispulinga dhyaihena upanishad says kaivalya upanishad they don't think about that word na bhumi rapo na cha vannirasti na cha nilome sti na jambaranca there is no bhumi there is no apaha there is no prithvi there is no any akasha vayu agni upanishad says kaivalya upanishad very closely this topics comes but students they don't listen junior students they don't bother and the half uh, this is called selective amnesia selective amnesia means i like the creation i want the creation creation is real 
So, it is real for you, for your mistake you want to emphasize that and you do not want to give your ear to that statement of the Upanishad. There is no creation at all. That is important to know. That is the selective amnesia. Many students, they come with their own inhibitions, ideas. Once Upanishad also talking those things and all, they are very happy. So, anything Upanishad talks against to their inhibitions or already pre-consumed ideas, they keep them aside. They never receive or register those statements. Ah, these are all done by that mind only. Ah, and they carry away by that mind. That's why intellectual honesty is required. Intellectual honesty is required. If it is not there, you are the loser. Sorry. <laughs> you are the loser. Therefore, Upanishad is doing Anuvada Vakyam. There is no Tatparyam in Anuvada Vakyam. So, uh, Nitya Mukti is the teaching. You are ever Muktaha, free. In I lend existence to the world. I support the world. I am the Adhisthanam of the world. I am the observer of the world. I am the experiencer of the world. The world, then I am sufferer of the world also, if I do not understand. If I understand, I am watching the uh, all happening as a sport. That is uh, the way we have to look at it. So, Upanishad, what is existent cannot be negated, what is not existent need not be negated. Upanishad is negating the universe here. Okay, Nishedha means negation. Negation of, not experience, negation of reality. If it is uh, really there, Upanishad cannot negate. Since Upanishad negating means, if it is not at all there also, Upanishad need not negate. Look two statements. If world is really there, 100% real it is, how Upanishad can negate? Upanishad can need, cannot negate. Suppose, no, 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 world is not at all there. Hundred percent it is not there. No. Upanishad need not negate. Upanishad cannot negate if it is Satyam. If it is totally absent, if it is not there at all, world is not there at all, Upanishad need not negate. Then why Upanishad negating? What Upanishad negating? World is neither Sat, world means your body, mind also. Okay? World is neither Sat category nor Asat category. World is neither existent category nor non-existent category. Then what? World is existent, non-existent category. Sadasad Vilakshanam. It is neither Sat nor Asat. Sat, Asat, Vilakshanam, different. Anirvachaniyam. This world is Anirvachaniyam, inexplicable. That is called Mithya. Whatever is, uh, whatever uh, is uh, neither come under neither existent nor non-existent, whatever is seemingly existent, temporarily existent, experientially existent, that alone Upanishad can negate. This is the law you have to remember. This is the law. Whatever seemingly existent, that alone Upanishad can negate. That is what Upanishad is doing now. It is supported by me. It is supported by me. It, I am the lender of the existence to the world. So, it, I, am, it, I am supporting, I am the supporter, I am the observer, I am the what everything. Uh, therefore, what now? I am the projector also. Waker projected the dream. I am the projector of the world. I am the supporter of the world. I am the uh, experiencer of the world. I am if you are Agnani, sufferer, sufferer of the world because of the world. 
Pame Gnani, no suffering. That is why, look into the next portion. Now, example over Drishtanta over. So, what? Tathache Bhashe Prakrutaita Vatvadhikarane Varnitam Loka Prasidham Twidam Rupa Dvayam Brahmani Kalpitam Param Rishati Pratishedhatva Ye Shuddha Brahma Swarupa Pratipadana Ye Che Iti Niravadyam Iti Tasmas Chutinam Prapancha Vishayam Anadara Deva Tadutpatikramasya Eka Vidhatvena Varnane Yatraha Tadutpati Vishaye Shrutinam Vigana Darshana Deva Prapancha Nishetha Eva Shrutinam Nairbharyam Na Tadutpattau Na Tadutpattau Iti Gneyam Now he concludes with the support of Brahma Sutra Bhashyam Acharya writes Bhashya Brahma Sutra for that uh, uh, Vyasa Sutras, Brahma Sutras, he writes uh, third chapter, second uh, Pada, sixth Adhikaranam, that is um, Prakritai Tavad Adhikarani. In that Adhikarani, in Brahma Sutra, it is given in the brackets 3 to 6. 6 means not Sutra, but Adhikaranam. In that Adhikaranam, that sutra, it is in this adhikaranam that sutra comes for that acharya root bhashyam. Bhashya, bhashye varnetam. Adhikarane, bhashya means Shankara acharya bhashyam. Adi Shankara acharya root bhashyam. We saw Brahma sutra also fully. What acharya root inverted commas begins here? See, loka prasiddhantu idam rupa dvayam. He takes murta murta brahmana. Idam Rupa Dvayam. In Brihadaranyaka also it comes Rupa Dvayam Murta Prapancha Amurta Prapancha. In Brihadaranyaka um, Murta Murta Brahmanam. Two, three, second chapter, third Brahmanam. Uh, Akasha Vayu comes under Amurtam. Invisible, subtle. And um, Agni. Water and earth comes under murtam, visible, tangible, gross, like our physical body. Mind is invisible, comes under amurtam, amurta dravyam. So, murtam and amurtam, both of them are created, given in the Upanishad also. Murtancha, murtancha, <laughs> they are all based on murta murta brahmanam so the world has got murtam also amurta dravyam so that is visible and invisible five elements the three are visible two are not visible that is why many things are invisible for you and some of them are visible so that body comes under visible <clears throat> Vayu, Agni, Apaha, Vayam, Air and Akasha, Mind comes under Invisible, Abstract, Concrete and Abstract. So, uh, Murtancha, Amurtancha. Then Upanishad also says, uh, Brother and Neti Neti, Na Iti, Na Iti. Run two uh, times it is says. One na iti, this is not real, this is not real. Why two times? Amurtam is also not real. What is subtle also, Akasha, Vayu are not real. One neti is for that. Another neti, neti means not ghi. Na iti is called neti. Neti, na iti is for tangible universe. Tangible universe also unreal. Untangible universe also is unreal. Sarupam. Brahma is in the beginning, it is given. Then what? Arupam Brahma, later. Nirvisesham Brahma. So, Savisesham and Nirvisesham. Savisesham is the only method of teaching. 
you cannot go carried away by that uh, rupa and that's why isha ashay arumingal ashay arumingal isha nodayunum ashay arumingal that ishvara is also kalpitam kalpitam for upasana sake for your upliftment you want to carry away by that nama rupa and fighting in the name of religion with the name of god then uh, you are like a muttal and a vadigat in a muttal and artha intelligent people make use of that rama form krishna form and do upasana meditate and get the blessings and say goodbye hey krishna you and i are one and the same anna atma drishtya hanuman shloka oru shloka gnapam irkana enna shloka enna i will take 2 minutes more today deha buddhya tu dasoham i am from body standpoint hey rama i and you are different i am your dasa jeeva buddhya tu tvadamshakah from jeeva standpoint i am jeevaatma you are paramaatma i am the part of you he said visishta dvaitam first line is dvaitam dvaita philosophy of mudvacharya second line is for uh, ramanujacharya visishta advaitam hanuman says at names of ramajacharya madhvacharya you won't say uh, jeeva buddhyatva damshakah what third line advaitam atma buddhyatva mevaham from atma buddhi lakshyartha standpoint i and you are one and the same therefore this is my nischita matih iti me nischita matih this is my conclusion he rama see this is called hanuman okay so tadha ache bhashye in the shankara bhashyam of in this adhikaranam varnitam loka prasiddhantu idam rupa dvayam these are very popular brahmani kalpitam murtam ana murtam all are kalpitam paramrshati now it is referring here ಪ್ರತಿಷೇಧ್ಯತ್ವಾಯ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಸೇಕ್ ಆಫ್ ನೆಗೇಷನ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಸೇಕ್ ಆಫ್ ನೆಗೇಷನ್ ಅಭಾಷ್ಯಕಾರ ರೈಟ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ರಿಫರ್ಡ್ ಬೈ ದ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಮೂರ್ತಾಮೂರ್ತ ಬ್ರಾಹ್ಮಣ ಶುದ್ಧ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಸ್ವರೂಪ ಪ್ರತಿಪಾದನಾಯ ಟು ಎಸ್ಟಾಬ್ಲಿಷ್ ಪ್ರತಿಪಾದನ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಟು ಎಸ್ಟಾಬ್ಲಿಷ್ ಹೂಮ್ ಶುದ್ಧ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಸ್ವರೂಪಂ ದ ರಿಯಲ್ ನೇಚರ್ ಆಫ್ ಪ್ಯೋರ್ ಕಾನ್ಷಿಯಸ್ನೆಸ್ ಚ ಇತಿ ನಿರವಧ್ಯಂ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ನಿರ್ದೋಷ ನಿರವಧ್ಯ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ಬ್ಲೆಮಿಷ್ಲೆಸ್ ಫಾಲ್ಸ್ ಲೆಸ್ ನ ದಟ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಟು ಎಸ್ಟಾಬ್ಲಿಷ್ ತಸ್ಮತ್ ಶ್ರುತೀನ ಇನ್ ದೀಸ್ ಶ್ರುತಿ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರಪಂಚ ವಿಷಯ ಅನಾದರಾದೇವ See, there is no other for creation in the Upanishads. Tadu patti krama kramasya in the order of this creation. There is no any adharam. There is no any uh, compassion towards that world, unreal world. Eka vishayatvena varnane na yatnaha. It should be only one. Every Upanishad should talk only one thing. ಪದ್ಧತಿ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಷನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ನೆವರ್ ಟ್ರೈಸ್ ತದ್ ಉತ್ಪತ್ತಿ ವಿಷಯ ಶ್ರುತೀನ ವಿಗಾನ ದರ್ ಈಸ್ ಎನ್ ಇನ್ಕನ್ಸಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸಿ ವಿಗಾನ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ಕನ್ಸಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸಿ ದರ್ಶನ ದೇವ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಸೀಯಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರಪಂಚ ನಿಷೇಧ ಏವ ಶ್ರುತೀನ ನೈರ್ಭರ್ಯ ನೈರ್ಭರ್ಯ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ತಾತ್ಪರ್ಯ ಇನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ತಾತ್ಪರ್ಯ ಸೆಂಟ್ರಲ್ ಟೀಚಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ only in negation only in negation viganam arupam brahma is the end that is the tade mm, tat brahma apurvam anaparam that is brihadaranya upanishad says that is the idea viganam inconsistent ch prapancha nishedhah ನೈರ್ ನೈರ್ಭರ್ಯ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ತಾತ್ಪರ್ಯ ತದ್ ಉತ್ಪತ್ತಿ ವಿ ತದ್ ಉತ್ಪತ್ತೌ ಇತಿ ಜ್ಞೇಯ ನ ತದ್ ಉತ್ಪತ್ತೌ ಇತಿ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ದರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ತಾತ್ಪರ್ಯ ಇನ್ ದ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಷನ್ ಓಕೆ ಮೋರ್ ಇನ್ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್
ஓம் பூர்ணமத பூர்ணமித பூர்ணாத் பூர்ணமுதே பூர்ணஸ்ய பூர்ணமாதாய பூர்ணமேவாவசிஷ்யே ஓம் சாந்தி 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 ஹரி ஓம் ஸ்ரீகுருபோ நம ஹரி ஓம்